to either hit the slopes or the beach, but streamlining your makeup and toiletry bags can be really tedious. Here to help with products that are not only travel friendly, but also targeted to your particular destination is beauty expert, Michelle Kazmi. Hi. Hey, Michelle. Some people are really organized packers when they yes. go away, and then some people are Cynthia, um, who they pack light, which means they don't pack enough, and then they rely on their friends like me to borrow things constantly. True, it's true. I am the mom, I have all the supplies, but you are the beauty expert, so tell us, what is like the, the, the art, the, the perfect secret sauce to packing everything that you need, but also not overloading your case? Yes, so I like to have a packing strategy in place. So I prioritize products that will multitask and save room in my luggage. So for example, if I'm packing a blush, I'll pack one that also functions as a lip color or a moisturizer that also works as a hand cream. So you want to pack less things that do more for you. Okay, so we're going to get started and we're going to get started with cold weather temperature holidays because products are going to be different depending yes. on where you go. So yes. for cold weather holidays, we are going to need a serum. Yes. And let's talk about this one. So this serum is from Elizabeth Arden, and unlike a traditional bottle, yeah. So unlike a traditional bottle, they come in biodegradable single-dose capsules. So they're so cute. Oh, no. Yeah, they're really they're really travel friendly. Lots. They save a lot of room in your luggage, and it's a dry oil serum. It has vitamin C and ceramides in it, so it helps moisturize your skin, brighten, even out your skin tone, and protect against environmental damage. And the capsule format is really to help protect the vitamin C and keep it stable and fresh until you're ready to use it. And the capsule has enough product for your face, your neck, and your hands. Oh, look at us. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> okay. I love this. So after your serum, are you gonna go with your sunscreen next? So. If this is hydrating enough for you, you can go straight to your sunscreen, but ideally after you want to use moisturizer. Okay. Uh, cold climates really dry out our skin, so you would like us to pair this process with a, a mask. And I know that at our hotel nights, we always do a mask anyway, because they're just fun. <laughs> yeah. But let's talk about this particular one and why it's great for cold weather. Yeah. So this is a mask from First Aid Beauty, and it was formulated to soothe and calm dry and irritated skin. So it's great to travel with, because that's usually when your skin and really acts up, yeah. whether you're on a plane or you're on the move. So this one was formulated with calming ingredients like um, calendula, arnica flower, and centella asiatica, which you often see in Korean beauty. Okay. So this one is really good. It's a leave-in mask, so you don't have to worry about rinsing it off. Love right. It. You leave it onto your skin for about 15 minutes, let it absorb, and massage the rest. What in. time of day? Oh, it's interesting. You can use it any time you want. Ooh, I wasn't okay. expecting oh. the color. Yeah, so this will absorb into your skin. So you just leave it on like this for 15 it's minutes. It's not a peel-off. No, it's not no. a peel-off. Oh. So you could wear this at the middle of your flight okay. and then just massage it in, especially if you don't like using a sheet mask. Okay. Or, you know, or when you come off the hill and you've been windburned from skiing. I don't oh. ski, but okay. <laughs> Um, so when, when do you, how do you know when your skin needs this type of intense treatment and how often would you recommend using this? Yeah, so something like this, you really want to reach out for it when your skin feels really tight, irritated, blotchy, and this could be, yeah, exactly, after skiing, if you ski, it could be during a flight or even when you land. Okay. So I always like to wear a little bit of blush. I yes. think it just brightens up your face. And you say this blush is, is perfect for cold weather. Yes, so this is from Maybelline New York. They're little blush tubes. They're super cute. Oh, so cute. They're, they're water-based cream gel formula. Okay. And there's six different shades you can choose from. And it gives you a nice natural flush, but you can make it as subtle or as intense as you would like it to I be. Love I love that. that. And you can yeah. use this on your lips and on your cheeks, Exactly, right? exactly. So it's multi-purpose. Okay. So you just apply by... Your hands, dab, so you dab, can dab, even dab. leave your makeup brushes at home. Got it. Let's talk about this next product you brought, which you say is, a, is a, another multitasker that everybody sort of needs in their lives. Tell us about it. Yes, this is Belita Skin Food, and it is a beloved beauty product for good reason. It was formulated for cold weather, dry skin, and it has ingredients like chamomile, rosemary, and sweet almond oil. It smells oh, yeah. so good and it's, fresh. Yeah, it yeah. smells so good. It's perfect for colder weather, especially if you're spending a lot of time outdoors. Yeah. 
And it's really good because you can use it for so many different things. You can use it for dry cuticles, for rough elbows, feet, to tame frizzy hair, even as a natural highlighter. I'm going oh, into my so cuticles okay. right now. Highlight, like I could just do this? Yeah, so you would oh. apply it on top of your makeup, just dab it on the high points of your cheekbones, and you just oh, get like a little, little yeah. Yeah. I love it, I love it. Okay, come right along over here. Let's okay, go so to... We're done with the snow. Yes. Now we're at the beach. Yes. We're wearing... <laughs> We got our G-string on, okay? <laughs> All right. These are specifically formulated for hot weather, hot weather, right? Yes. Okay, yes. so we'll start like we did on the other side with yes. the serum. So which serum is best for the beach? Yeah, so when you're vacationing somewhere warm, you you want an effortless, easy skincare routine, which is why I really love Olay's Press Serum Sticks. So stick? They're sticks. So it's a hydrating serum, but it comes in a solid stick format. It's super easy to use. You literally just glide I it onto your skin. I've never seen stick serum. Yes, yeah, so there's, <laughs> there's three different Our hands are gonna be ridiculously <laughs> soft. Here yeah. we go. So you can use Down a brightening wrist. one, you can use a refreshing one, or Ooh, a hydrating so one. Yeah. And it has, each one has a different star ingredient. So you could have vitamin B3, you could have cactus water, or even fermented sake. Okay, yeah. hey, these smell great. They smell really good. <laughs> um, let's talk about, when you're in hot climates, there's nothing yeah. worse than like putting on a heavy foundation, yeah. right? And you start to look like you're melting. And streaky. It's, yeah, totally. Yeah. So uh, let's talk about why you love this CC cream. So this is from It Cosmetics, and it's one of my favorite CC creams because it gives you the best of skincare and makeup. So it gives you all the benefits of a full coverage foundation, but without that cakey, heavy oh, texture. Yeah. It's matte. Yeah, yeah. so this yeah. is an oil-free formula, and it has a natural matte finish. It reduces shine, it holds up against heat and humidity, it has SPF 40, and you can use it as a concealer, a color corrector, primer, it's an all-in-one. And it has a good range of skin tones? Yes. Amazing, yeah. okay. Okay, so what is 40 SPF, so do, yes. you, do you still need sunscreen on the after, like before, after, or when do you do that? Yeah, so I always feel like sunscreen is your non-negotiable. So apply your regular sunscreen first, then mm -hmm. apply this over top for added protection. Okay. Let's talk about cream. Yes. Um, this is warm weather cream though. You, yes. We had some pretty intense creams over there. Yeah. So for warmer weather, you, I, I'm assuming you want something a little bit lighter? Yes, so this is from Pour Moi Skin Care and okay. they formulate we'll products yeah. specifically for Pour the moi. climate. Pour Moi. For yeah. the climate you live in instead of your skin type or your age. Okay. So this is their Desert Day Cream, and it was formulated specifically for hot and dry climates. Yeah, so it's really light, okay. and that climate could be Morocco, it could be Arizona. Okay. Um, oh yeah, it is light. It's yeah. packed with antioxidants, there are peptides in there, lightweight oils, and it also helps protect your skin with against temperature fluctuations. So if you were going from like extreme heat and going into air conditioning, air conditioning okay. this protects your skin. Nice. And as you saw, you don't need to use a lot for your entire face, just one or two it's drops. It's really nice yeah. and light. It is beautiful. Okay, so what is a beauty segment without a facial mist? Yes. I'm a huge fan. To me, they're mm. a brightening thing. They finish your makeup. There's so many uses for it. Talk about why you love traveling with this one. So one of my favorite mists is MV Skincare's Rose Hydrating Mist. This one is made with pure floral water. It's right on me. <laughs> okay, okay, wait, wait, and okay. it has real rose petals in it as well. And that's not just to make it smell good. <laughs> oh. It oh, yeah. actually has anti-inflammatory and hydrating properties as well. I feel like I just buried my face in a bouquet of flowers. <laughs> well, you look, it's, it, you have that glow, like you just sort of stepped out of the pool and Thank you're like you. flinging your hair around. <laughs> Thank you. Um, Michelle, I feel like just like I've been refreshed, like I've been on a little vacation. Thank you so much for you're bringing welcome. this amazing car.